Hey there, how are you? I hope that all's well and everything is absolutely amazing on your end. Welcome back. This is your light in darkness and I am back again with another update and another interesting read for all of you once again. I can't explain how funny it is today. How it's making me laugh because this is just out of the world. The way I see justice is getting served here in your favor is making me laugh real hard right now. Okay. After a really long period of time, something like this has come up which is just out of this world, literally out of this world. I see here that the project, the venture, the business of whatever it is you're working on or had been working on is going to be very successful. You are going to receive a lot of abundance, fame, fortune and love because of your work. I see here that finally the things you said, predicted and declared are going to happen using your spiritual gifts, talents and abilities which is what's going to shake your counterpart's world as well as the world of the people who messed up with your connection. Okay, the interesting thing about this read is that the moment you receive this success, you achieve this goal of yours and you get famous, I see that people are going to come crawling back in your life. And this is making me laugh real hard. You know why? Because suddenly everything is going to flip up. Okay, as soon as you achieve this milestone as soon as the word gets spread, as soon as you become famous, as soon as things are gonna start looking good for you, these people who messed up with you, who mishandled you, who disrespected you, who abused you, targeted you, humiliated you, bullied you, are going to get called out for their behavior and their actions. Okay, and that's going to flip back everything in their lives. Then after that, real drama is going to start. Then these people are going to start saying that it was just a misunderstanding and they never meant any of those uh, abuses and that disrespect, they never meant to disrespect you. They had no intention of targeting you and things like that. They'll just try to, you know, dust themselves off from the effect of their own dark deeds they'll start saying that all's well in between you and them and there's no bad blood i see that these people are going to try to get listed in your good books which is not going to happen okay it's all because of the karma that's going to strike back it's all because of them getting called out on their ugly behavior and actions it's all because of even your counterpart turning against them after realizing the truth, it's all because of people rejecting them, people treating them the way they treated you or they deserve to be treated. It's because of them getting thrashed out and thrown out of places, projects, ventures, or even job opportunities. It's all because of them getting exposed. They'll start the real drama there you'll see a complete different side of these people. I see that even these people are going to try coming back in your life to end things on a peaceful, positive note. Because after you receive this success, after everything comes to light, their lives are going to start falling apart and they'll have nowhere to go. They'll have to hide their faces. So in order to avoid that, I see these people actually trying to get in your good books and making offers of reconciliation, friendships and whatnot. The interesting thing is that they are going to get rejected even with those attempts as well. I don't see you accepting any of these people nor can I suggest you to because even divine isn't telling you to do that. You cannot accept this bullshit this drama and this the circus that's gonna happen or 
that which these people are going to create you have to and you should put these people in their places and let it be known that they were always in the bad books you never really had any intention of putting them in your bad books they just listed themselves in your bad books because of their own actions behavior mindset and wrong deeds it will be all known to everyone another thing i'm seeing here is that after seeing you grow after witnessing your success your glory and the fame you're going to receive after seeing how people are going to admire you respect you adore you love you unconditionally even your person is going to come back to their senses and are going to start making attempts of reaching out and returning back in your life and the interesting thing is that i don't see you in that state of receiving them positively or politely i just see that a lot of you have achieved this level of self love and empowerment where you are not ready or willing to take any disrespect or drama or bullshit or nonsense from anyone even if it's your own person your own counterpart i see you rejecting your counterpart that too quite harshly and uh, bitterly though i won't suggest it i won't recommend it but i just see this happening here okay it's not like it's something wrong you'll be doing or are thinking of doing your person deserves this for what they have done the way they mistreated you the way they disrespected you in the past the way they blocked you out from their life the way they assumed the worst about you because they were listening to some stupid imbecile idiot people they deserve this kind of attitude and treatment from you i'm not saying that you'll do it to take revenge or out of spite or something like that i see that there's still some sort of anger within you or little rage or it's just that you do not trust this person at all the trust is all gone and because of that i see you putting this person your counterpart in their place you'll be making it clear that you are in no mood of attracting or you know entertaining any kind of drama you let them know that you've lost all interest in them you do not trust them at all and you are not interested in making things work with them anymore okay god knows what he's trying to cook here what he's planning what he's aiming to do but it is just funny i see that the people who messed up with your connection the people who blocked your union in the past the people who turned your person against you and um, instigated them against you are going to witness all of this happen they're going to witness this fame of yours this abundant state of yours this glory of yours this charm of yours this new transformed version of yours and then i see that they'll try to block your person from reaching out to you because they'll see that now things are flipping out they're losing control the tables have turned or are just about to so i see them creating conspiracies once again in return of that i see your person blocking them out and kicking them in their places okay because by that point of time everyone's going to get exposed it's because everything you said declared and predicted in the past is going to come true i see your person standing in their power all awakened after realizing that you were always true there was nothing negative about you there was nothing skeptical about you there was nothing evil about you but there was everything negative evil and skeptical about these people they had in their life and that's when i see that the drama is going to get real amongst all of them i see your person actually putting these people in their places and actually thrashing them out in the same way you might thrash your person out as bitterly as you might do this is what is making me laugh here i'm smiling right now it's just so funny and so interesting i'm just surprised okay i'm completely gobsmacked right now 
this is what you call poetic justice that's how i see things are going to turn around this is big this is huge i don't see you entertaining any of this drama any of these people you don't even want to deal with your person here or you wouldn't want to but i still see reunions happening here i still see marriages happening here i still see this we a turn of events taking place because of divine intervention it is divine will to bring you two back together no matter what you think about it no matter what your person thinks about it or these other people it is divine will that divine lovers are going to come back together then it is what's going to happen and no one can stop that even you cannot but that doesn't mean god's suggesting you or recommending you to accept your person like nothing wrong happened and your person is all innocent or you should just accept them because they're coming back no not really you can stand on your ground firmly you can you must maintain strict boundaries you must abide by them let your person know that you're doing so let them struggle let them receive the taste of their own medicine let them see the real faces of the people they chose and prioritized over you let them see their bitterness once they see everything coming true everything you predicted actually happening or just is getting served it'll be a sight to watch i mean the look on these people's faces it'll be a sight to watch for sure clueless blank emotionless all flustered irritated annoyed surprised confused bitter angry jealous feeling rejected abandoned lost defeated what not and you'll fly high higher than ever i see god taking you to heights even you cannot imagine right now that's how successful and prosperous this project of yours is going to be if it involves you using your spiritual gifts talents and abilities or the wisdom you've acquired all throughout these years i saw number 1717 17 while i was saying all that and that's a confirmation sign okay this is interesting i love it i love the energy of today's reading really god knows the best i'm telling you that god knows how to put people in their places god knows how to turn the tables how to flip everything back how to change the game unexpectedly it's not like you're going to do anything here you just have to focus on yourself on your work your goals ambitions your spiritual growth and development and research and study that's all you won't even do anything and i see you winning here in the end i see you coming out victorious which is just going to burn these people completely from within they wouldn't have anything left to do or say instead i see them actually trying to look like they are your admirers and lovers and friends long lost friends which they never really were but i see them acting the way that way that's interesting it's going to get interesting really interesting so be prepared because a lot's about to happen a lot's about to change and you'll be really surprised because i see unexpected events taking place here okay as i said i still see reunions happening here and god knows how it's going to happen i don't know how it's going to happen only god knows what he has planned and what he's going to do there's one thing i can tell you it's because divine lovers are supposed to lead their lives as positive examples divine's going to make sure that reunions are happening no matter how conflicting the situation looks at time that's something you can keep in mind because that's the purpose okay that's the purpose behind bringing unions and reunions or marriages divine lovers marriages so that's what i see is going to happen one way or the other because it is the divine will and no one can stop that so even if you are not interested in taking them back or in some cases if your person comes back wearing a mask then you should actually put them in their place and you shouldn't you shouldn't accept them back but still i see that god's got a way a miracle a breakthrough for you where after which after seeing that after receiving it things are going to work out how i don't know when i can't really say it's just that you have to wait for the divine right timing and then you'll see how things work out okay it's all under divine control 
it's all going to happen as per your divine life plan as per the divine will when the time comes you'll see it all happening okay just have trust have faith release everything all your expectations and um, any doubts you have surrender everything just focus on yourself that's all you have to do here i just see that you'll come out as a completely transformed individual and just by seeing you looking at you people are going to burn with jealousy and envy that's how beautiful i see your transformation is going to be that's how amazing i see you're going to come out of this dark phase or after or after this retreat you've been in i saw number 22 22 right when i said that so that's again a confirmation sign it's going to be big whatever is going to happen it's going to be big okay i see you looking your best self i see you glowing with abundance and prosperity and love self love actually not really the love of your person because i see that by that point of time you'll be fine being with your own self even if it means spending your life as a single individual i don't see any fear in you i don't see any regrets or remorse or any kind of apprehensions i just see that you'll focus on leading your life as a positive example you'll shine your light as bright as you can and you'll just be there out there in the limelight for people to see okay that's what i see which is what's going to turn everything around for you so that's all this was your reading for today i hope that you enjoyed listening to me and it brought you the clarity you were seeking or hoping to get if so do let me know how you felt in the comment section below feel free to hit the like button and do subscribe to our channel for more such content to be readily available for all of you on a regular basis with that being said do not hesitate to follow through with the link given in the description box below if you'd like to contribute donate or show your love and appreciation also if you are interested in taking a personal reading to contact me or consult with me through your my given email address provided in the description box below that's all i'll be back sooner than later till then take care of yourself and your loved ones bye bye